we're just about to begin the Easter Triduum, the days of Holy Thursday, Good Friday, Holy Saturday, in which we bring to life again and make present in the liturgy those last days and hours of our blessed Lord's life on earth. And this Holy Thursday in particular, we are thinking about the two most central sacraments in our lives, the institution of the Holy Eucharist at the Last Supper and the institution of the priesthood whereby the Mass is made present to us, Jesus is brought to us in the Blessed Eucharist. And I ask you to pray on this Holy Thursday for all priests. Normally we would be in the cathedral on this day with our bishop renewing our priestly commitment but we can't do that this year and each of us priests are going to have to do this individually in our parishes before the Blessed Sacrament on Holy Thursday evening. So do pray especially for us priests as we do this. And I want to pay tribute in a particular way at this time to those priests who have put themselves on the front line in dealing with this coronavirus epidemic. The many priests in Italy, for example, over 50 priests who have died in this pandemic. And in our own diocese, the half a dozen priests who have volunteered to be chaplains at the Nightingale Hospital down in Docklands. Uh, they blessed the hospital there yesterday and there's going to be a priest available on call each day for the sick, for the dying and for the staff there. So please keep them very much in your prayers um, at this time. As we go into these days of the Triduum, let's do so with a special intensity this year, realising that although we cannot be present at these liturgies, we can follow them at home, live streamed, following the prayers, the readings of the liturgy, perhaps using our missal or using one of the apps like the Universalis app to help us to participate as best we can, not ideally, but according to the means whereby we can make ourselves one with this action of Christ for us, who suffers, dies, and offers himself to us, to the Father. And we await in anticipation already these days, the joy of Easter Day, when I hope to be able to greet you all again. So God bless you and please pray for me.